Hello, teachers, and welcome to Ask a Geek, where your questions will get answered with as little geek speak as possible, hopefully concise. Um, today's question comes from Wilkinson Junior High. Yay, Lisa Cussler. Lisa has a great question. This would totally fit for a lot of different people. Uh, so she would like to know how to create a letterhead and uh, inside Google Docs. Well, this is, um, we, I had provided a bit of artwork for each of the teams anyways, and so she has the artwork, and she wants it to essentially become a Google Doc. So I thought I'd quickly show you and her how to do this. So um, I'm going to go into their folder. They have a team folder. Here sits the artwork inside Google Drive. And the artwork could be you know, on your computer or in a thumb drive, but we'll go with this particular piece of artwork. You're going to go to New and Google Docs. Open up a Google Doc. Title it up anything you want. In this case, we'll call it Team. Oops. Team Letterhead. And then we'll come down here now. Because she's asked specifically for a letterhead, I'm going to go to Insert, and we're going to go down to Header, and click on Header. We've got this space up here that it provides us. So now we're going to insert that artwork. At this point, you could insert artwork. You could actually do some just um, you know, words in here. Uh, but uh, we've got the artwork. We know where it is. You have the ability to go into your Google Drive or upload it from your computer. Hers is in the Google Drive, or this particular artwork is in the Google Drive in a folder called Golden Eagles. So we'll kind of keep there. Sits that artwork. So that's what we want. This particular artwork is larger than what we want for a letterhead. So I'm going to crop it. This is a unique skill inside uh, Google Docs. You go up here to the crop image. First of all, maybe I should say you make sure your image is highlighted. Click on it so you've got the blue highlight around it. Go up to crop, and you're going to get this these strange little corner edges here, and you're only going to use those. Wait till you get that arrow, and click and kind of drag it right to the edge because you want it as small as can be. Click it and drag it right to the edge. Notice it's not making the image smaller; it's just kind of cropping your edges. For you're going to go back up once you've kind of got it where you need it. You're going to hit crop again. And it makes it small, but it's still not small enough. So you're only going to go, and you're not going to go back to crop, you're not going to go to, you're just going to go highlight your artwork so that you have your blue, and you're going to go to only to the corners. Do not go to the sides, only to the corners, and make it smaller. So you're going to kind of drag it smaller, and that's about the size she probably wants it. Um, that would look right, and of course you have to even it up. So you're going to kind of center it in the middle, or if you do want it on one side or the other. So in this case, we'll make it center. You click off of it, and there is your letterhead. Well, Lisa, I hope that helped. Hope that answered your question and many others. Thank you guys for your questions. Keep them coming.